And because I'm a member of parliament, I think all of us look forward to hearing what the president is going to say. And what do you wish the president says today? Unfortunately, I'm not a prophet. I don't know what he's going to say. <laughs> but, but, but if I were to answer your question, I really don't know what you, you will say. Because he made many promises before, even before the economic climate you know, de got deteriorated, you know, which were not fulfilled. And, and unfortunately, the, the recession, the, the fact that our economic growth has gone down to the extent that we are almost, according to rate, those who do, uh, have rated us as, as just above a junk state. So uh, in those circumstances, it's difficult to predict what he can say. Are you pleased with the actions that the presidency and his cabinet has taken to meet with CEOs of companies to come up with a plan that will hopefully save us from going to junk status level? I, I think that's a very good thing. I must congratulate him for that. I think that was very clever, especially in the present climate. I think it was the right thing f uh, for him to do because it is better to, to actually to, to impose the people who create all jobs it's not government. Government creates only the climate. And, and the, these uh, captains of industry are the people that must create jobs and invest money. Are you pleased with the Constitutional Court um, developments this past Tuesday uh, relating to the powers of uh, the public protector? In fact, yesterday I attended a cocktail party at the British Co Commission and I saw the, the public protector there and I congratulated her and said, you know, when the lawyers top lawyers in the country were arguing, it was like music. Fantastic. Thank you very much. Wish you a good evening.